So the last set of exercises, three moves. They're gonna be a little more high intensity. We're gonna start incorporating some plyometric movements. Uh, the first one's gonna be standing, doing some leg moves. The second one's gonna be on the mat in a push-up position, doing some upper body work, and then we're gonna hit some abs. So go ahead and stand up. We're gonna get on one leg and stabilize as if you were running high knees, so that leg's up nice and high. The toe is pointed up, pulled to the shin. Arms are ready to go at a 90 degree angle, front and back. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna switch, switch, and then you're gonna laterally jump, stabilize, stick that landing, come back up, switch, switch, laterally jump, stabilize, stick the landing, and then back up. So full speed is gonna be Just like that. And we'll go back and forth. You got 10 each side. At five, I want you to not worry about the stabilization part and just go quick. Boom, boom. Back and forth. So five with the stick, stabilization. Five each, doing it quickly. And then we're gonna be on the ground after that. Try to go right into it. You're gonna be in a push up position. Tap the shoulder, tap the shoulder. Plyometric push up. Tap, tap, plyometric push up. 10 of these. So tap, tap, push up is one. The last one, the hardest ab exercise no one ever does, is a seated L sit leg lift. Legs are long and straight, toes can point. And then the key here is to lean forward a little bit. So you're not leaning back at all. You're not even perfectly upright. You're gonna reach forward a little bit. The more you reach forward, the harder it is. So start a little bit, just like slightly lean and then really try to lean into it. But you're gonna flex the quads, raise the legs. If you can raise them more than three inches, then reach forward a little bit more. You don't wanna plop them to the ground. You just wanna lightly set them down. And even better, you don't wanna to touch the ground at all. So you try to string them together like this, see if you can reach forward a little bit more. 20 of those. So the jumps, we have five stabilizing each one, five each, and then five quick, five each. The push up ones, the plyometric push ups, you're gonna tap, tap, do a push up, you have 10 of those, and then 20 of the leg raises. All right, that is three sets. That's all for the workout. So you have nine total sets. We got three different groups. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Got the heart rate up a little bit. Got things burning. Felt the, felt the hips. Felt the hip flexors a little. I hope everyone's uh, keeping it together mentally during the quarantine. I know it's you know a tough time right now, but now's the time to try to get as active as possible to keep the mentality there. Really try to focus on your breath work while you're doing it. All right, have a good one.